Hey guys, we're gonna do a haul, another haul. Today is Friday. I did not vlog this morning on the way to work. Um, let's see, what is today? I was trying to, uh, today is January the 24th. I didn't vlog this morning. Sorry, my tummy's hurting, so I've got some horse juice to try to help. Ugh, hair. Anyway, I didn't vlog on the way to work. It was cold. I didn't know if there's still ice on the roads, and I just really needed to keep my concentration there. So, now, let's just get started. I have a haul from... Oh, where should I start? I mean, goodness gracious. Let's just start with the j &L. I stopped by the j and Closeout. That's the one that I told you, you know, it's the outlet. And let me show you what I found. I got another one of these. It was $3. It's the uh, beverage warmer where you sit your coffee cup on top of the warmer. I bought one of these for my husband for Christmas. And because, you know, he usually sits his coffee cup on his table by his recliner or he gets busy, forgets, takes a nap, whatever. And when he's ready to drink it, it's cold. So I thought this will be a perfect Christmas gift for him. And it was. He loves it. And the other day when I was home on my day off, I was drinking my coffee. And my coffee kept getting cold because I'd get busy. You know, I was I was uh, doing my calendar. And um, my coffee kept getting cold. So he's like, well, here, use my warmer. I'm telling you what. Let me just tell you. If you're looking for a gift for a coffee drinker, a good gift right here. This thing was the bomb.com. Just set my cup there and when I was ready it was just as hot as it was when it when it came out of the coffee pot. So anyway, three dollars. Three dollars for that. Yeah. Awesomeness. I went in there to get this. It is whoops. Sorry guys. I went in there specifically to get this. I was wondering what I'm wearing. I'm still in my scrubs. I just got home. We just got home. After work, we went to Walmart, went to eat and all that stuff. And yeah. And I have a cold, yes. If I sound like I'm nasally, which I'm always nasally. <laughs> so, okay. Garden Party Lighted Animal Topiary. I love these things. It was uh, down here $19.99 and I got it for $5. Yes, sir. Ray Bob. Five dollar. There you go. That was my yeah. And it lights up. Well, let me just show you right here. See? It lights up. Can y'all see that? It's just so stinking cute. Or maybe this way. Can y'all see it where it lights up? Yeah. Anyway, absolutely am in love with that. That is just too cute. Let's just sit him right here and let him just keep us company. <laughs> I love it. All right, that was JNL closeout. I think that's all I got there. Some days I can go crazy mad in there, and other days there's just not that much. Okay, um, Walmart the first time. I went to Walmart uh, with my consumer. My consumer wanted to go to Walmart, and um, and yes, if my consumer is in Walmart shopping, I can shop. So. Anyway, my eyes were watering, my nose was running, I couldn't breathe, I was just feeling a little sick. So, I got some daytime severe uh, cold and flu. We just go nip that sucker in the bud right now. So anyway, and I've already taken them too, I was like, oh, they don't feel good. Anyway, and then I got some pants, because y'all know I'm a pen freak, right? I love these pins. These pins are the best pins ever. I'm going to show you. They're the very fine print. They're the um, 0.7 millimeter or whatever they call that. Very, very, very fine print. I like these because y'all know I have a uh, calendar, a, not a, ca um, a scheduler, calendar. What am I trying to say? <laughs> anyway, home. Anyway, and I love these because, you know, sometimes you don't get very big squares and what I have to put in there. <laughs> I need some more pants. 
I well, I don't need more pants. I, I need more pants like I need a hole in my head again. Y'all know. Y'all know the addiction is real. Okay? It's real. It's real. Alright, let's move right on to Oh, Dollar Tree. I did go to Dollar Tree. Yes, sir, Bob. But now you know. You can't go to Walmart without stopping at the Dollar Tree. Well, that is because our Dollar Tree is like, here's our Walmart, here's our Dollar Tree. So, you know, just right next door. I found these at the Dollar Tree. And, of course, two things caught my eye with these. Y'all could probably tell me when I show you what it is. I'm pretty sure y'all can point, pinpoint the two things. Number one. The coffee, coffee time. Number two, the turquoise, the Tiffany. Well, I call it Tiffany blue, but <laughs> how can you beat that? I mean, you know, it's it's like how can you beat that Tiffany blue? It's really a greenish kind of. I don't. It's not really green either. Well, to me, it's a Tiffany blue. You know, that's what I'm calling it. Tiffany blue in the coffee time. That is what drew me to this. I just love it. Don't you just love it? Don't you just love it? Okay, so that was Dollar Tree. Where can I put these? Let me put them right there. And then I got some more, some more water, um, these little, I don't know what they call them, they're sugar-free. Um, you know, you add them to your water. This one is pineapple. This is my husband's favorite right here. And this is my favorite too. And then I got him Orange Crush, which before the Orange Crush was his favorite, but now the pineapple's his favorite. We both love the pineapple. It is very good. You should try those. To put in your water bottle, you know, put in your water. And then I got a Dollar Tree. Uh, this says Ready to Use Roll-On Aroma Guru Lavender Roll-On. And it says you just roll it on your wrist, lavender. Cause you know they say it calms you let me just tell you what it does okay lavender essential oil helps relax and de-stress see i told you um promotes whole body tranquility excuse me calms <clears throat> calms heightened emotion helps restore skin complexion well who knew that lord i need a bigger bottle for that um, helps soothe skin irritations and burns. Did y'all know that? I didn't know that. Promotes restful sleep. I definitely need that. According to my watch, my sleep is poor. Um, so, lavender roll-on. Since you just rolled it on your wrist. I actually bought this for my mother because she has trouble sleeping and, and she has anxiety. And I bought that for her because I thought, hey, if that works, by George. Then I got some more pretty straws. Y'all seen, you've probably already seen my haul. Um, well, no, I haven't put it up yet. I got some black and white straws. Well, you will see it before you see this one. Um, some black and white straws from Miss A. Well, I seen these um, at, um, how many times can I say, um, Dollar Tree. These are turquoise and black. Turquoise and black, or brown, is that a dark brown? It may be a dark brown. It's a dark brown. But the reason why, I, I love straws, guys. I drink with straws. And look, would you just look at the, at the coordination in this? Would you just, could you just look at the color? The color, the color code, the color, whatever it is I'm trying to think of. Y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and then, oh, I got some catnip. For my little kitty, for my little fidget. Some catnip. Oh, and we got her this scratch thing, but hubby's already got it up and it's in the living room for her. It's a little thing where she can scratch and it's got a little ball hanging where she can play with it. And does she like it? No. She went over to try to start scratching on my stinking ottoman again. I'm going to beat her if she don't flip. Okay, and then I got some scented wax melts. These are mango pineapple, pineapple again, there's that pineapple, and basil and bergamot. Anyway, oh, this smells good. Here, take a sniff. Here, ready? Sniff. Scratch and sniff. Scratch and sniff. Scratch and sniff. Anyway, oh, it smells so good. 
I couldn't pass that up once I smelled it. Let me tell you something in our Dollar Tree, okay? I went over to the candles because all you guys are hauling all these real cute candles and the cutest little vases. And, you know, you're like, oh, these smell so good. Y'all should smell this. Oh, they smell wonderful. Yeah, 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 yeah. Our candles stink, okay? They, if they smell like anything, they smell like toilet water or they just don't smell at all, okay? They're just a burn. They're, they, yeah. So when I seen these, I was excited. I was like, hey, these actually do smell good. They did have a, they had a candle in there that was in the cutest little, um, a little jar. That candle stunk to high heaven. It's like, why? Why? Why can't I have some cute candles? You know? Okay, anyway, then the last things I got, I got four of these. Where's my other two? I guess I left them out in the car. Anyway, I got some more boxes of tissue because you know they're only a dollar and I always look for the ones that have the most sheets in them and this one has and these are two ply by the way huh. I buy the the paper towels that are in the two ply you know where you can rip them apart and that way you don't waste a whole paper towel you don't need a whole paper towel because you just need to wipe your little mouth and you don't need you don't require a whole big paper towel okay anyway <sighs> No, I haven't had any bang today. I'm just running on. This is just plain goofiness. Okay, who am I kidding? I'm just this way. This is just how I roll. Anyway, 175 sheets. I always look, because they have all different kinds. They have the Scotte tissues. You know, you got to have the Scotte because it's Scotte. But they didn't have very many in there. And they're all a dollar. They're all the same price. So why wouldn't you want to get, you know? Why wouldn't you want to get one that's, that's got the most in it? So, I got four of them. Here's two. And the other two, obviously, is laying in my car somewhere. Or it may be out there. Because I think I did take one out already. Okay, are y'all ready for the Walmart haul? We got one more to do. Alright, let's do this. Okay, let's do this. Okay, well, I did show y'all the first Walmart haul, which was the pins and the daytime, <clears throat> you know, stuff. So let's continue on. Okay, the second trip to Walmart is my little flushable wipes. Now we've been through this story before, not even once, twice, I believe. I believe I've done, when I've done a haul, I've had these in my haul twice and I've told you what I use them for, so we're just not going to continue down that road, okay? Y'all know what I use them for by now. And if you're new, go watch the other videos, okay? Okay? Actually, I just put them in my bathroom by the toilet paper because, you know, sometimes people just like their little tush all clean. They just don't want it. You know what I'm saying? You do. You know what I'm saying? So, anyway, that's what these are for. Just keep your little tush clean. And then, a three-pack of Crest. My hubby got these because this is, uh, this is what my hubby uses for toothpaste. I don't use this. I use, um, the uh, whitening, what is it, Colgate whitening, it's the, it comes in the red tube, you know, it's the whitening and whitens your teeth, yeah, that, so anyway, this is hubby's, that's what he got, and then, oh, what is in this, oh, and from Walmart, we got some dewormer solutions for my little kitty, she's not a kitty, um, her fidget, you guys have seen fidget in in some of my videos, if not all, because she's a little nosy, little Miss Nosy. She likes being right up in your business, you know. So, anyway, we got some dewormer for her. And then we got that scratch post thing that, I don't know if she's going to like it or not. I don't know. So, I want a hubby to build her one. Like, the big, tall ones, you know, that's got the, where she can hide. And Let me tell you something about my cat. She's a Siamese, Okay. And let me tell you what they say about Siamese. Well, I don't know what they say about Siamese because I'd be a lie if I told you what, what they say because I don't even know what they say. But let me tell you about my Siamese. She's moody. If you put her somewhere, she'll get down and walk around and then go back to where you put her because it has to be her idea. Okay? Like if, even if you go to the door and you, you know, you think, okay, it's time for her to go outside. Because my cat, well, I don't have a cat litter box in my house. Okay? We don't, we don't do that. She goes to the door. When it's time for her to go to the bathroom, she will run to the door. And 
we let her out. Well, there's just sometimes you think, okay, she's been in here long enough. She needs to go to the bathroom. And so if you open the door and say, Fidget, do you want to go outside? She'll just do her head, turn around, and walk away, okay? And then after you've walked away, then she'll turn around and walk back to the door. And then look at you like you're a fool for not opening the door, okay? That is the Siamese in her, okay? She is a mess, let me tell you. So, the scratch it thing, I guess because we set it down there and pointed it out to her. She's just not all about it, so. Anyway, she's finicky, okay? And I know all cats are finicky, but the Siamese... And a cat is just so different. They're so, they're stubborn. They're stubborn and they're pouty. Anyway, at Dollar Tree, I did get some, this is the last thing from Dollar Tree. I did get some catnip and I'm going to use it. She thinks she's got me full. I'm going to fool her because I'm going to put this on her little scratch it thing. And you know the little camper that I bought that I set on my fireplace? You know, it's really a doggy bed. Well, I would like for her to sleep in there. I mean, it's cute. It's a camper already. You know, what cat gets a camper? And I put a blanket in there and everything. But she went in there, she turned, she came back out. So if I put some catnip in there, I'm thinking she may hang out. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, we'll see. If she ever gets in there and stays, I'll take a picture of her. Okay, last but not least from Walmart. We were coming from the makeup aisle. Um... Actually, well, not, well, yeah, the makeup aisle, but I wasn't shopping for makeup at that point. I had, I was shop, doing the wipes, and the wipes are over by the makeup, you know. You know. So, anyway, so we're coming down the aisle, and there is a thing of pillows, okay? A thing of pillows. And I see this. And, of course, y'all know. I mean, y'all know. I have to have it, right? Y'all know it's, it's a necessity. So, when I seen it, I just walked straight to it, picked it up, put it in the bag. Now, hubby didn't even ask questions because he already knew. They just know. Yeah. He already knew. Here we go. Look at this pillow. Love with a sunflower. How cute is that? Is that not the cutest ever? I mean, does it get any cuter? <laughs> and then the back. Same way. Now, y'all know I have a white couch. White leather couch. One of these days, I'm going to get rid of it. I don't like leather. Let me just tell y'all something about leather. If y'all have leather and you like it, then yay you. But I hate it. Well, in the, in the wintertime. You sit down and it freezes you to death. You sit on it and you're like, yikes, until it gets warm. And then you're okay. But it's just cold. It's just cold. I don't like it. I will never buy leather again. Anyway, this will match my leather because the white... The red will match because I have my pictures of my guitars, you know, the guitar pictures. And what else do I have in there that's red? Flowers? Anyway. And, of course, I have some flowers in there, too. So, this is just going to go lovely. Okay. And I only bought one to go my couch's recliners. And then there's a console in the middle. And this recliner, I'm in all the time. So, I just wanted it for the left one. And I'm just going to drip the little Arkansas razor back blanket over it and then just put this on top. And another thing about leather. When you sit pillows, they just go, they slide, you know, because there's no traction there because there's stupid leather. I'm sorry. I don't like leather. I, I really don't. I mean, I used to always think, oh, I want leather. They look so nice and they're so pretty and I'll bet they're so comfortable and... I don't know what world I was living in at that point. Obviously not a real one. So anyway, guys, this is, um, I'll take that off later. This is my haul. This is my J&L closeout haul, my Dollar Tree haul, and my Walmart haul. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. It wasn't very long, was it? Was it? Was it? I can't wait to... <laughs> You see, it says try me. That's what this is for. Now I'm going to have to figure out how to rewire that to down here. I think I just put batteries in it down there and it's all, it's all good. You know, now. All right. You hear my husband? He's in there playing fidget. So I don't know if he's aggravating her or she's aggravating him or she's playing. She's actually playing on the little thing that we got her. I don't know. So, but I'm going to get off of here and go get out of my scrubbies. And of course, there's nothing more comfortable than scrubbies, is there? But I'm just going to go get coffee and enjoy the rest of my Friday night. This is Friday.
Friday evening. Um, my grandson Hunter has a basketball game in the morning, so we are going to try to go to that. So, and I got to go take some more medicine because I am just, I don't feel good. My head stopped up and I have a headache. You know how it is when you get the colds and you're just like, you know, yeah, well, that's how it is. That's just how it is. My ears itching. All right, guys, that's it for now. Hope you enjoyed my haul. Remember, thumbs up on my video, subscribe to my channel, click the bell for future notifications, and that's it. That's all you got to do. It's just those three little things. Three little things. And I will see y'all. I'll see y'all on the next one. So, bye-bye. Okay, guys. I wanted to show you these leggings that I bought. They're Secret Treasures. And um, you get one pair. I get the large, extra large. And they're like the ones I have on. I love these leggings. These leggings are just the bomb.com. I can wear them with dresses. I can wear them um, like I'm wearing with a shirt and pants and a cardigan. I just, I just love them. So I wanted you guys, I wanted to show you guys that I, ah, what they look like. Cause I'm always wearing them and I'm always talk, telling y'all or showing y'all what I, how I wear them. But I never tell you guys where, and I got these at Walmart. Anyway, so this is them. Shaping leggings. Too cute. Okay, and then, okay, then I bought a new dress. It is just a plain white black dress, just a black. That's what I was looking for. I was looking for just a plain black dress. And then I bought a red cardigan. I love this kind of material, too, because it's warm. A red cardigan to go over it. And then with that, I am going to wear um, my leopard booties. I think it's going to be cute. Stay tuned to my Instagram for outfit of the day for Sundays. Sunday's outfit of the day. So later.